strawberry and blueberry dessert. You guys, it's going to be less than six ingredients for this entire dessert. It's actually a very cheap dessert to purchase as well as an easy and quick dessert to make. So let's go ahead and get... All right, first we're going to start off with some strawberries, some blueberries. You can just have our strawberries or blueberries. You can have other fruit, but try to use fruit that are less that have a stronger sweet taste because we're going to add a sweetener to this dessert. So let's go ahead and get started. Wash off your blueberries and your strawberries. You can also wash your blueberries and your strawberries um, with some a little bit of vinegar, baking soda, and water and let it sit. Or just rinse them off. It's your preference. So my blueberries are in here. And we're going to go ahead and cut up our strawberries. You can cut your strawberries up however you prefer to cut them up. I'm going to do a rough chop. Because the blueberries to me are already kind of small. So I want to make sure I have a contrast of bigger, piece of, bigger pieces of fruit and smaller pieces of fruit. That's how I like my dessert. So it's up to you. It's the season. Strawberries are on sale. So it's a little bit cheaper at this time to get strawberries to make this dessert. So we're going to have a cup of strawberries and we're going to have a half a, half a cup of blueberries. Ingredients will be in the description below. And guess what we're going to start with? We're going to start with zesting one line. So... I wasn't raised on putting lime, not lime, you guys, lemon. We're going to add one teaspoon of sugar. We're just going to mix it up, y'all, and that's it. We're going to let it sit. I'm going to say at least 30 minutes. 20 minutes is okay. Get some of this lime off. Lime, lemon, lime is lemon, not lime. But... It's, I say wait 30 minutes because that's when I, you really see a little bit of the liquids coming out of the fruit that you will um, want on your dessert. But you can let this sit for hours or overnight. Now that we have everything we need to allow this fruit to go ahead and start doing its works with the lemon as well as the sugar, we're going to let it sit at least 30 minutes in the refrigerator. You can let it sit overnight or you can let it sit for hours before you go ahead and make this wonderful dessert. Alright guys, I'm back. So mine's have been sitting for, I'm going to say, two and a half hours. So we're going to go ahead and open it up. Y'all, it smells so good with the fresh um, lemon in it. So guess what we're about to do. You're going to get your dessert shells. You can get this from any grocery store. I'm going to use two. You can use one. It's up to you. And we're just going to put it on the plate. As so as you guys can see gonna put it on the plate and then we're gonna go ahead and scoop in the fruit now you can have it as much or less fruit as you want I'm gonna be using all the fruit that I chopped up and I like a really good presentation you guys so We're going to just put all this fruit in here. Remind you, it's a cup of strawberries and a half a cup of blueberries that I have in mind. We have a little bit of the juice. We're going to use all that. We're going to use all that. Like I said, I like a good presentation. And then I'm going to use almond milk. Ready whoop, you guys. Yes. And then they have a coconut milk version, too. You're going to shake it up. And we just, it's... Uh, two tablespoons for a serving. So we just gonna all right. This is our final masterpiece. We're gonna go ahead and probably do a look. Put some dabs of it and certain parts and yes i do this for myself you guys so this is the wonderful dessert the calories will be um on the screen you guys so i hope you guys make this 
easy, quick, healthy dessert. Don't have that many ingredients. And guess what? It doesn't cost a lot of money to go ahead and get these items to make it. So I hope you guys make it. If you do, comment below. Let me know if you like the lemon. Let me know if you use a different type of sweetener. And let me know if you use a different fruit. So y'all enjoy.